Hello everybody, today's tutorial is going to be on how to get started using Final Cut Express. Okay, before you do anything else, before you do anything, you need a clip. So let's import, I'm going to import three clips. And to import it, you're just going to go to File, scroll down to Import, and hit Files. Then you can just choose your clip. Alright, once you have your three clips, they should all be right here. And right down here, this is our timeline. This is where we're going to drag our clips and be able to play them back. So the first clip I'm going to drag in is this one right here. And if you just drag it in and play it, it's going to give you this. And it won't let you play it. It says unrendered. But to render it, you just select it by clicking on it and hit Command R. And since I haven't saved my project yet, it'll give me this message, but I'm not I don't really care. So I'll just click OK. And then it'll start to render it. Once it's done rendering, I can play it back. So there's my clip. Now if I want to make, if I'm editing a video, I'm just going to do the same and put all my clips right here. So I'll put this second one in. I'll put this third one in. But just because I rendered this one doesn't mean that these other clips are going to be rendered. So watch this. Okay, so I have to render both of these clips. Alright, now all three of my clips are rendered and I can watch them. Alright, it's as easy as that. And then to put a song to your video. Um, if you're switching from iMovie, you obviously don't see any buttons where you can really put any audio or music. But it's to put music in, it's basically the same as putting a clip in. You're going to go to File, to Import, to Files. Then you just go to wherever you... I usually put the song on my desktop, and then I select it right here. So let's just put this one in. Then I choose it and it pops up right here. And when I first put it in, it's going to be really long so I can just shorten that down by putting my mouse on the edge of it and just shortening it down. and then there's my music and I also have to render the music if I want it to play in my video so that's rendering and yeah there is your song alright so now I have my clips and my music in and it's all rendered so I can play it Alright, so that's just how you put clips and music in. And to enter text, there is a little button with an A on it over here. Then you just click on that, and it'll bring up this menu. And then there's a couple different kinds of text. I usually just do typewriter or regular text. And right here, nothing will show up, but sorry, if you just click on it and drag it into your timeline, it'll show up. And it's usually really long. I don't know what happened there, so let's just move this all back. And it's usually really long, so I can just shorten it down. And I'm also going to have to render this when I'm done. 
but to change the text you're just going to double click it go to controls and type in whatever you want and then I'll just type something and there you go and it should update pretty soon. yeah see there it goes and you can change the colors right here you can change the spacing right there how far apart you want it to be I'll make it really far apart location you can make it go higher or lower yeah and there's your text then when you're done typing your text you have to render your text let's just wait for that Alright, so now everything is rendered. I have my text, my clips, and my music. So here we go. Obviously, I forgot to render this clip or the audio or something. But yeah, sometimes things get like when you put new things in, like music or like text, it usually just. I don't, I don't really know like unrenders itself so you have to re-render it so yeah that clip wasn't rendered either sorry about that just re-render all of this alright now everything is rendered and I have my text clip and music so here we go Alright, so now you know all the basics in Final Cut Express, so go make a video. Thanks for watching.